What's going on YouTube? My name is Devlin and uh, today I'm doing something a little bit different and I'm playing COD 4 but I'm playing a game type that I have never really played before until uh, just a couple of days ago and that game type is old school free for all and the idea of this game type is that it kind of takes you back to the the good old days of first person shooters where you had to go and pick up your weapons and stuff and you know the jump was kind of high and you didn't regain life over time, you know, once your life was uh, brought down a certain amount, it, it stayed there until somebody killed you and you respawn with full health again. So, um, I, I started playing this game, and it's kind of hard to find a game, though, because there aren't that many people on Call of Duty 4, and there are even less people on Call of Duty 4 playing old-school free-for-all, and there's generally only about 80 people at a time uh, in this playlist, so it can be a little hard to get into a game sometimes, and even when you do get into a game, the uh, the latency is usually, uh, it, can, it can be pretty bad, but uh, it's a really fun game type, so I kind of stuck with it. Check out that awesome LMG spray, that was just amazing. Um, so yeah, I've got, uh, I've actu I'm actually re-commentating this because I've been having trouble uploading to YouTube, and uh, since I've recorded my first commentary on this video, I've got some new things to say, so I'm going to re-commentate it, and then hopefully the uh, upload works a little better, a little bit better for me. Uh, thank you to Dist, who uh, pointed me in the direction of a new uploader, like the adv I think it's called the Advanced Uploader. Hopefully I have a, uh, a little more success with that, because YouTube has been a nightmare for me lately, and it's not cooperating, and it's making me very, very upset. So, uh, yeah, this, uh, this game type's a lot of fun, and if you guys have never tried it, I suggest you do. And uh, if any of my subscribers want to play this game type with me, I'm down, because I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, I've learned a few things about this game type in the uh, in the few days I've been playing it. The first is, it's kind of hard to get a good kill-death ratio in this, because as I said, your health doesn't regenerate. Uh, you spawn with a lot more health than you normally do. Look at this, this is probably the worst sniping you've ever seen on YouTube. One shot out of five, nice. Um, yeah, like I said, uh, you don't regenerate, but you do spawn with a lot more health than normal. But the thing is, when you go up and you've got to get a whole bunch of kills in a row with continually decreasing amounts of life, it gets pretty tricky. So getting a good kill death and getting any decent kill streaks is pretty difficult. Um, like as you see there, I took a lot of damage in that firefight, so yeah, I can pretty much guarantee in the next firefight I'm, I'm probably going to go down in just a, a couple bullets. Uh, so yeah, pretty difficult to pull out an amazing kill death ratio, and it's uh, pretty difficult to get a good kill streak going. But um, it's, it's still a fun game type, and I really like the nostalgic uh, the v nostalgic value, I guess it has. And it kind of brings me back to the days where I was playing N64 and, you know, running around with my, with my Moonraker laser in GoldenEye. So it's kind of a little blast from the past, and that's a lot of fun for me. Uh, I also want to talk about a few videos that I'm going to have up in the near future. Uh, one of which is a Geometry Wars video, because Geometry Wars is getting pretty big again. I'm not sure if you guys are all subscribed to Machinima or not, but... Uh, Geometry Wars is blowing up on Machinima all over again. And we've got Hutch and Shore Wars and Tabe and all kinds of different people all competing in the pacifism game type, which is uh, a game type where you can't shoot anything that's chasing you. You have to go through these little bars that blow up everything in the vicinity. And uh, it's a lot of fun. It's probably one of the most addicting Xbox Live Arcade games I've ever played. And uh, I got it a long time ago, but kind of just kind of drifted away from it. I don't even know why, really. But uh, I'm trying to get back into it now, and as it stands, I'm not that great at it, but what I'd like to do is post a, a, post a video every now and then of me playing Geometry Wars, kind of showing how I'm, I'm going to gradually get better. Well, I'm hoping I'll gradually get better. It'd kind of suck if I just kind of you know, stayed the same the entire time. That'd be a bummer. But um, yeah, that would be, uh, that's pretty neat, I think, just so you can see, you guys can see my progression as I go along. Uh, they won't take up the Wednesday and Saturday commentary video slots. I'll just post them in between. They're probably going to be short, you know, like three or four minutes each, uh, if that. So hopefully you guys are excited to see some Geometry Wars, and hopefully you guys aren't epileptic because seizures will definitely ensue if you are. Um, another video I want to get up is my first Armory video. Uh, that is in the works right now. It's just a matter of adding the finishing touches to it, and... Um, just getting it kind of polished up for you guys. Uh, the first episode will be about the UMP-45 because that's a pretty hotly debated gun. A lot of people say it's very, very overpowered. It's a super duper tryhard weapon and you can only obtain it when you put on your tryhard pants. So I'm going to cover that one first and give you my thoughts on it, whether or not it's ridiculously overpowered or if it's, you know, on par with other things. Uh, hopefully that will be up soon. 
Another video I want to get up is the uh, open lobby highlights from my second open lobby. I've been really bad with this, guys. Um, I just really haven't found the time. There's about three hours of footage there, and I really haven't found the time to sit down and watch the three hours worth, comb through it, pick out different parts, edit it all together. Um, there's a lot of hours of work going into that. So I, uh, I've been putting it off, I'm not going to lie. And I apologize if you were in that open lobby and you're kind of excited to you know, see yourself. And um, I am going to get to work on that as soon as possible. And again, I do want to apologize because I've been procrastinating like a motherfucker. So hopefully that will be up soon as well. Um, I think there was another one, but I, I, yeah, I definitely forgot what it was. Um, I don't know. You get your regular Modern Warfare 2 fix because I know that's what most of you guys are into is Modern Warfare 2. Uh, I'm playing COD 4 a lot more, not just... Not just the um, old school, but just regular game modes as well. That game's a nice break. You don't get moved to nearly as much, as I'm sure you guys know. You know what really pisses me off, though, is when I go into COD 4 because I want to escape the noob tubes, and you get some dick who just is exclusively noob tubing. And I feel like he's probably there just to piss people off. And his train of thought is probably, everyone's here to escape noob tubes, so I'm going to noob tube them because it'll really bother them. And for any one of you who do that out there, curse you curse you how dare you do this to nice people it's just evil it is evil it's like dr evil and 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 the bad guy from sonic robotnik combined into one it's just not good so if you do that guys don't do it anymore please i implore you you must stop yeah all right so um i'm officially out of things to talk about you guys are probably used to that by now i, I usually run out i think it's because i talk too fast my girlfriend mentioned that to me one time because every time I do commentaries, I run out of things to say at the end. And she's like, well, maybe if you would just slow down a little bit and not talk so fast. Like you just ate 17 packs of Skittles. And I'm always like, quiet, woman. I'm just kidding. I don't say that. <laughs> but uh, I think she may have a point because I do ramble on pretty quick. Uh, not to sound vain, but my brain moves so incredibly fast that my mouth just tries to keep up with it. But it has a very hard time, so... Um, that's why I was talking so fast, and I apologize. I'll try and slow it down in the future. But, uh, anyway, guys, this wraps up this game. I really hope you enjoyed it, and I hope YouTube stops being a dick and lets me upload this tomorrow, because I'm re-commentating it on Tuesday. Uh, thanks for watching. I appreciate it, as always, and pizzizzle, a nizzle, whizzle, dizzle.